All right, uh, in this video, we're going to be unboxing the Jackery 500. This is Jackery's second largest um, portable power station. It was the largest one for a while uh, until the new Jackery Explorer 1000 came out. So let's see what's inside the box. Probably another box. Oh, this one's good. They got, I mean, that box is in the box. is real tight on this one. It's good. Good packaging there. Okay. So, this is the Jackery 500, Explorer Power Station, 518 watt hours. It's always nice when the watt hours is actually over the, uh, the number. You know, it's like, I think it was Goal Zero had like the 200X and it's only got 187 in it. Anyways, so this is nice. It's over 500 watt hours. So good capacity compared to its number. I always like that. So let's get this party. Started. I can open things. Okay. Okay, inside the box, first thing. Charging, cables. Alright, what have we got? Okay. Throw the box away. Manual. All that jazz. This is smaller than I thought it was going to be. Just like first thoughts of what it feels like is I was um, I was thinking it was going to be a little heavier. So this is nice. For 518 watt hours, it's um, it's pretty like pretty easy to, to grab. You know, I love the jackery handles. So, you know, that's not a change. But uh, nice got the DC output there, USB. Uh, no USB-C, but can't have everything. Um, AC port on the front, which is always nice. Got your standard display here, shows your capacity, input, output, all that. Um, inside here, it's probably the DC and AC chargers. Yep, so DC charger and uh, AC power brick. So that's everything in the box for the unboxing. Um, and just as a quick comparison, if you want to see, this is a 500, this is the 240. And uh, if you wanted to see versus the larger, this one's a little harder to uh, kind of manhandle, but this is the 1000, so this is the 500. Oh boy, I gotta put that down. That's getting a little heavy. Um, does have the uh, old flashlight on it, which is kind of interesting. Which ones have the flashlight and which ones don't? Like the 240 doesn't, the, uh, the little 160 does, which totally makes sense, and then the 1000 doesn't, or 1000 does, sorry. So. Kind of weird that the like the 300 and the 240 don't have a flashlight. I don't know why, but uh, 500 does, which is cool. Probably run this for a while. Um, well, let's see how many watts that's put. In. You know, it says zero. I wonder if it's not counting the flashlight. That's interesting. Because I mean, it's got to be taking something. I mean, oof. Anyway, okay. Jacket Explorer 500. Uh, good size. I like it.